Hi, I'm Dr. Swarchla, Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. Very often when couples come to us for fertility advice or treatment, one of our advices which involves lifestyle modification is to hydrate yourself well. Let's understand the importance of hydration in fertility. Hydration is a very critical yet often overlooked aspect of overall health including reproductive health and fertility. Proper hydration plays a very significant role in maintaining the optimal functions of various bodily systems which can directly or indirectly impact fertility in both men and women. Let's look at the importance of hydration in fertility in detail. We'll first begin with hormonal balance. Hormones regulate many aspects of the reproductive system as we know, including the menstrual cycle, ovulation, sperm production and sexual function. Adequate hydration is essential for the body's ability to produce and transport hormones. Water acts as a solvent in the bloodstream, facilitating the efficient transport of hormones to the target tissues. Dehydration can lead to thickened blood, potentially impairing the delivery of hormones and nutrients. The endocrine system responsible for hormone production requires a stable internal environment to function properly. Dehydration can disrupt the balance of electrolytes and blood volume. This can impact the synthesis and secretion of hormones such as estrogen, progesterone, testosterone which are very critical for reproductive health. Dehydration also has an effect on cervical mucus production. Cervical mucus plays a very vital role in female fertility by creating a supportive environment for sperm survival. Hydration affects the production and quality of cervical mucus. Adequate water intake ensures that cervical mucus remains thin and stretchy which is essential for facilitating sperm movement through the cervix and into the uterus during ovulation. Dehydration can lead to thicker, less fertile cervical mucus, making it more difficult for sperm to reach egg. It also has an effect on sperm quality. Hydration is equally important for male fertility, particularly concerning sperm production and quality. Semen is composed of various fluids including those from seminal vesicles, prostate gland and bulbo-urethral glands. Proper hydration helps in maintaining adequate semen volume which is very critical for sperm transport and fertilization. Dehydration can negatively impact sperm motility which is the ability to swim and viability. Adequate hydration ensures that the seminal plasma which provides nutrients and medium for sperm to swim remains optimal. This can improve sperm motility and the overall chances of successful fertilization. Body's detoxification processes uh, most importantly carried out by the liver and the kidneys are essential for removing toxins and maintaining a healthy environment internally. Proper hydration supports kidney function allowing for the efficient elimination of toxins and metabolic waste. Accumulation of toxins due to dehydration adversely affect reproductive organs and hormones. Liver also plays a very important role in hormone metabolism and adequate hydration helps maintain liver health ensuring that it efficiently metabolizes and clears excessive hormones and toxins from the body. Hydration also ha has an effect on general health and stress reduction. Overall health and stress levels significantly impact fertility. Chronic dehydration can contribute to general fatigue decreased physical performance and increased stress levels all of which can adversely affect reproductive health. Dehydration can trigger the release of stress hormones such as cortisol. Elevated cortisol levels can disrupt the hypothalamic pituitary gonadal axis leading to irregular menstrual cycles in women and reduced testosterone levels in men both of which can impair fertility. Hydration also has an effect on blood circulation and nutrient delivery. Hydration is very critical for maintaining adequate blood volume and circulation which is critical for delivering nutrients and oxygen to reproductive organs. In women, proper hydration helps in maintain healthy endometrial lining which is essential for embryo implantation. Good blood flow ensures that the endometrium receives adequate nutrients and oxygen. In men, adequate blood flow supports testicular health which is necessary for production of healthy sperm. So, what are the recommendations for optimal hydration? Daily water intake is very important. When individual needs vary, it is generally recommended that adults consume about 2 to 3 liters of water per day. This can vary depending on factors such as your body size, activity levels, climate and overall health. Consuming water-rich foods such as fruits and vegetables can contribute to overall hydration. But you have to monitor hydration status. Signs of proper hydration include clear or light colored urine and regular urination. Yellow, dark yellow, 
urine infrequent urination and a dry mouth are a common sign of dehydration so hydration is the foundational aspect of reproductive health that influences various physiological functions which are essential for fertility from hormone regulation to cervical mucus production to semen quality to detoxification maintaining adequate hydration is very important for both male and female fertility and couples trying to conceive should prioritize proper hydration as part of their uh, comprehensive approach to optimize reproductive health to understand more about this please feel free to contact us thank you a lot of effort has gone into making this video please like and subscribe us thank you